We welcome the arrival of the new year. Harry has decided that I broadcast the names of the victims he has deemed worthy of my broadcast. I will show you the name, face, and sin of three of Kira's victims that I have been allowed to show you. Then I will show you the name of other sinners that have been judged by Kira. George Michael of the George Michael Sports Machine was a white supremacist who advocated racism and discrimination. By the end of his program 2007, he retired off the wealth that he acquired through favoritism he showed on behalf of his sponsors, and his nationally syndicated show became the norm in the industry. It was because of his influence that the sports media industry became inclined to make him stereotypes and racist comments to athletes and fans all over the world. George Michael spread hate and racist bias to millions and finally got what he deserved. James Victor was a paraplegic who often sang about death and who built himself a significant number of followers throughout his life. He struggled with suicide, substance abuse, and death have been well documented and are also well known. Despite his ability to play instruments, he was nothing more than a handicapped figure of pity and to have no fame or recognition attached to his name. Here is made it clear that no handicapped person without actual usefulness should be alive. James Victor was useless to society and deserved to die. James Owen Sullivan was the co-founder of Avenged Sevenfold, a band which advocates for sin, drug use, and violence. The band has become an icon for religious mockery, since they have been known to allude to verses and passages in the Christian Bible while having no religious attachments themselves, making the Bible and religion in general appear evil, aggressive, and psychotic. Because James Owen Sullivan was the band's song innovator, Kira has placed a responsibility in him and thus placed rightful judgment on him. He has inspired many people to follow his wickedness, but dead at last, the only inspiration he will give will be for his followers to not follow him anymore. The following are the names of other victims that Kira has decided to judge. He has decided for me not to broadcast their sin, as well as their picture, since he has deemed that unimportant. As you can all see, Kira has eliminated the icons of the past generation only to give way to the icons of the new generation for this new year 2010. It is his desire that as the singers of the old world die off one by one, the world will switch from being a world of darkness to a world of light. We are one year closer to the coming of the new world arriving in 2012, as has been prophesied since the beginning of human civilization. Let the support for Kira grow so that our new world becomes everything that we had hoped it would be. Kira has decided that I continue broadcasting the names of victims after the death, and that you need not concern yourself with the less well-known sinners whom he is also judging. I have not yet been informed of future victims,